Hi everybody, welcome to the wonderful world of the diagnostic version of Daisy. <laughs> no, we're not playing Tron, we're playing the special uh, Diag version of Daisy, which I'm told is very useful to modders and developers, um, because it shows things like hitboxes and collision boxes and um, paths for zombies, um, and it's generally a cool thing to go into. So in this video I'm going to show you how if you want to you can open this up and have a run around and kind of um, see see what you think and uh, it's, it's just really weird seeing the the engine room if you like behind uh, <laughs> that's my character <laughs> why is it that shape I, I just don't know I don't know okay so let's let's pause that let's leave that there and let's come out so the core of this is the Diag version of Daisy, but in order to run this, you need to have um, offline offline mode. And in fact, offline mode runs Daisy in its Diag version. So the core to this is basically starting off by using the Daisy community offline mode. So I'll put a link to that in the description below the video. And it's one of the most easiest things you can do. But what it does is it runs Daisy locally on your local PC. So you hit on um, uh, down here, download the zip of the archive. Um, that will then come down something like that, and then create a folder and extract it. And within this extraction, you'll see a README that kind of tells you what to do, and you'll see your missions. And depending on which offline mode you want to do, Chernus, Livonia, or Nemalsk, you copy that, and you copy that inside your Daisy folder where um, Daisy is. So um, let's go and have a look. So Daisy on my computer is under C, Program Files, x86, Steam, Steam Apps, Common, and there it is. So there's Daisy. So we're just going to Daisy, and we would right-click, paste, and you can see this is where they are. They're, they're already here. And then you go into the Chernus one, and you just scroll down, and you just double-click on Daisy Community Offline Mode. That's a .bat file. That's a batch file that executes a script that starts the program. Um, similarly, if we were in the Livonia one, Again, if we were to, to double click the Daisy Community Offline Mode, that would start it um, there. Now, once you're in, you'll notice it, it's, it's a kind of a normal version of Daisy, apart from the fact you've got some kit with you. Um, you may well think, oh, this is great, it's single player Daisy. It isn't because when you come out, when you quit, it doesn't save your progress. So it's fun for playing around with things and testing things, but it's not on the level of something like a local server where you can play single player Daisy and it's easier to test mods and stuff like that. However, once you're in, what you then need to know are the controls for the Diag mode. And so that's where you'll want to go to Bohemia Interactive Diag uh, menu. And I'll put a link in the description of the video. But basically, to open it up, on your keyboard, you press the Win key and then Alt or Control and the Win key. And then the menu will pop up. So can I do it here, actually? Yeah. Now, you have to hold down the buttons to make the menu um, stay and then you're using the backspace key to go back and then using up and down on your arrows to say go to daisy render then I'll go right arrow key uh, diagnostic mode geometry only and then I go left and right to change it and then if I press backspace I'll then go back to the previous menu and you can kind of play around like that if you read through the article below um, it, uh, the, the bit that's all about the um, bloody hell, what on earth is this all about? Oh, I'm, my character's lying down. Why are they lying down? You can, um, let's go to first person. You can kind of get an idea of, of some of the different things you can do. If you want to run the mod that um, Wobo runs to show you where bullets go, then um, this is the mode you have to be in. But you, if you read the instructions that come with the mod, um, that tells you exactly what to do. Whoa. I guess the, <laughs> the zombies. What is it? See, I don't know. I don't know where everything is. I'm going to get killed by zombies here. Gosh, it does look like Tron, doesn't it? I, I want to play Daisy like this. This is how I want to play Daisy. Oh, and uh, I'm, I've died. So there you go. So that's how easy it is. Now I'm not going to try and explain what this stuff does or what it tells you because I haven't got a clue. All I've really done is just shown you how to run Diag uh, mode in Daisy. Basically it's running Daisy Diag uh, x 64exe but that's what uh, Daisy offline mode runs in. So as I say, just to say it one last time, so in order to get into the Diag menus and bring up all that lovely Tron type stuff, run Daisy using the Daisy community offline mode and then 
you press the key combinations of the win key with the control, left control, or the win key, and left alt. And you get into it, and then just have a play around and see what you think. Anyway, that's enough from me. Hope you find that useful. If you have, hit like. If you want to see more of the same, press subscribe. And I'll see you again soon.